Hello everyone, Julia here, hello from Sweden and welcome to a new video and in today's video I want to show you my finished weekly journal, like weekly recap journal, memory keeping journal and I've been doing this kind of journaling since last year and last year I also used this uh, Traveler's Company diary uh, dated weekly vertical for uh, memory keeping and it worked uh, really great last year so I decided to continue with it this year and I will leave a link to two previous videos about this kind of journals to two journals like this that I finished last year I showed a flip through of them last year so I will leave a link to those videos now this one is finished this one was from January to June and I just finished to catch up on this journal I and mean, it took me some time to finish it I would like to fill all the um, all the pages in it like those last few weeks especially because I was traveling a lot in June so I basically used this journal as like a weekly recap for memory keeping and this calendar I didn't use also I didn't use this first few pages in the beginning I thought maybe I will use this for something but in the end I didn't use them and this first spread here I also still didn't use because I still had my previous journal I was working in my previous journal and this is the first spread in it and this is still in December last year last week of December so basically I just write down all the good things of the day, like some kind of special moments of the day, some things that I did during the day, like for example if I went for a walk or to a cafe or got a happy mail from a friend or letter or postcard or some new stationery or watched a new movie that I really liked or read a good book or had some nice journaling time for example so basically anything like any good small moments of the day and just decorate these spreads with different stickers sometimes I use the stickers that I got during the day for example if I got any new stationery or something like that then I would use some of that or something from the happy mail um, but usually it's just some random stickers that, that I have just something that I have laying on my desk and uh, all the spreads look kind of similar uh, I just like to decorate them with stickers sometimes with some stamps and write down all those good daily moments basically like a recap of the day it's really nice to have this weekly overview just to get an idea what I did during the week and um, about all those nice little moments of each day and I also use this journal a lot for testing the new stickers that I make for my shop so this mainly are the stickers that I make for my Etsy shop and this journal somehow it turned out to be one of the first journals where I uh, used these stickers myself before adding them to my Etsy shop Here you definitely can see that it's spring already because there are many butterflies and flowers and birds and it looks very very colorful and cheerful so these are definitely spring pages and as I said, I started to do this uh, sometime last year, I think in the beginning of last year and I really liked this format because it's very quick, you don't have to spend a lot of time 
uh, for journaling or decorating and you can do this just a little bit every day that's i that's how i do it now i don't decorate like the full spread in the beginning of the week i just start to add some random things uh, and just add a few more and more during the uh, during the week just see what what fits where sometimes when i'm traveling and like when i'm not at home during that week then I go back to it uh, when I'm already back home and then finish the, like the whole spread then already afterwards and that's what I had to do in June a lot because I think in June I spent maybe like seven days of the whole month in June and mostly I was traveling or somewhere on the festival or the concert but I am that kind of person who doesn't like to leave this uh, pages blank especially because it's dated i didn't really want to skip them and just leave them blank so i decided to fill them anyway and just did that already afterwards just added some stickers and wrote down a very short recap what i was doing on the day and uh, this is the last week of june and the last spread in this journal and i already started the second part uh, of it, uh, the second insert from July to December and I will continue to do it. And I still use the same Traveler's Notebook cover that last year and this is actually my first ever Traveler's Notebook cover. I really like it and I have here also this uh, monthly insert that I use mainly as a calendar for different events and appointments and also just write down some things like if I go to the cinema or if I have a shop update on that day just basically a monthly overview of different events mainly it's concerts and trips and sometimes also some personal appointments but I don't have many of those usually all my appointments that's concerts or trips and yeah, and I already started a second insert in July, from July to December. I didn't decorate the cover yet, so I still want to decorate this a bit and also the cover of this insert. I already started to fill the pages and this is the first week of July and this is the second one, so already two weeks are finished and yeah now I think yeah now we are on this week so I just started with it and didn't decorate anything yet just started to write a bit on Monday and that's it but I will continue with it until end of the year hopefully and uh, so far I really like this format of journaling it's very fun and very quick as I said and it's also really cool to have this overview then in the end of the year basically you have this two journals filled with memories of from the whole year like all the good moments of each day in my case that's how i i like to do it i like to concentrate on positive nice things in this journal and just keep those uh, good daily moments in one journal but of course you can do it in many different ways and, and can write down here whatever you want but yeah as i said uh, i really like this format and in the end of the year i will show you a flip through of the second part of this journal but that's it for this video i hope you liked it i hope it was interesting for you and inspiring and thank you so much for watching as always and see you in my next videos bye